So we are home now and over here we have some Chick-fil-A nuggets. I'm trying to get them. I can't really see what I'm filming and I have my sweet tea, you know. Um, and I'm really excited because I have, I've stripped the bed and, um, except for this pillow and the weighted vest that I'll take off later. Um, guys, two days, actually, no, after today, Wednesday, my bed shows up on Wednesday. I'm super excited. I cannot wait. Um, and also the diffuser is on downstairs which has peppermint oil in it and is already making me feel so much better um my allergies were just like up a creek and it was crazy and my brother is gonna come over i don't know it might be tomorrow he said maybe today or tomorrow but regardless has to be some point because my bed is gonna go over here so this is the couch and i'll move this and i'll put it somewhere um but i kind of let the dog when the dog's here stays on it because um, right now, um, the dog doesn't live here yet. Um, you know what I'm saying? Kind of thing. Anyway, um, the dog, no. The dog, the, it's actually my filming producer's dog. But I also call it my dog because we had an agreement. So yeah, anyway, this is for the dog. But he's not here right now with well, the weighted blanket. It's not. The weighted blanket goes on my bed. But I just kind of put it here because I like strip my bed. And um, so this couch is going to be moved in the loft. Because there's another couch that's in the loft. And, um, and, um like it it's just the longer one and so it'll go in there and my bed will go on this side and the headboard will go up here because that's what we want oh my gosh you guys i'm so excited like i can't even i can't even so even when you're sick actually my choir director told me like when you um i have an outfit that i'm gonna wear so apparently you guys one day i'm gonna wear this outfit it might be tomorrow i'll you know how much you can see um, but it's gonna, we're getting a cold front come in. Like, this weather's been yo-yo, for real. Like, this weather's just been yo-yo. Uh, anyway, but, um, so, yeah, even when you're sick, you still have to, uh, rehearse. So, <coughs> um, yeah, my choir director, he's actually the one that was like, yeah, when your voice is messed up and you're sick, it's actually a really good time to sing, because it clears it all out. And I was just like, what? But apparently that, and we do coat throat tea and stuff, but I try to do natural things. I really try to do, like, things that are good. Um, obviously, if you get in a situation where you need medication, I'm not saying I am against medication if needed. I'm just saying for my personal preference, I don't really want it for my body unless I need to. I'm already on treatment for my seizures, and that's good enough for me. Um, I just, I think if there's a natural way of doing it instead of taking medicine that's just my personal preference um medicine's giving has given me crazy side effects and i don't like it so i'm a musician i'm always thinking of ways to do it like one way they did say is like throat coat tea and like lemon and your water um and stuff like that so um, i'm gonna start really getting even more serious with that like i've been doing some of the stuff for the past couple of years but like i'm actually now that i'm writing more music and i'm doing a lot of things and actually having a lot of concerts, I it's actually crucial. Like, I have to do this. I can't just, you know, not not take care of my voice. Um, not that I was, like, not doing it on purpose. But, like, last year I was so sick. And there were at least three concerts I showed up with and I had no voice. And Jacob was like, how are you going to do this today? And I just looked at him and I was like, I have no idea. But I'll be there. And let me tell you, by the grace of God, I was able to sing. But after the concert, I was extremely hoarse. So yeah, I do have a sore throat, but I still have to rehearse. Like, I can't just not. Yesterday, I didn't know rehearsing. I was in bed all day. Wasn't, wasn't fun. But today, I'm up. I am doing laundry. I'm cleaning. I'm getting things ready. I actually slept all day. I'm not going to lie. But even so, I still have to rehearse. There's just no, there's just no, like, you know, no excuses. Like, I can't unless you're like my fever's gone if I still had a fever and I was in bed it'd be one thing but I you know what even if just like hanging around the house in sweatpants I have to rehearse so, anyway I think you get the point that I really need to rehearse I'm sorry I'm just I haven't rehearsed in three days and I'm kind of like it's less than a month now that we try out for America's Got Talent so I'm just going what's up guys um yeah so 
I've stepped it up a notch from pajamas to sweatpants. Uh, yeah, I know. They're not very pretty. And this jacket probably doesn't match. But, y'all, I didn't even vlog yesterday or film because I was super sick. Like, no kidding. My throat hurt. My voice was hoarse. I was in bed. And I'm not even kidding. I slept for, like, 24 hours. Like, the only times I got up was a couple times to eat and, and then drink hot chocolate that my mom made me. And that's literally all I did. And I slept today until, like, 2 and literally, I was like, "I'm just now waking up." There's Donald. He has some. He has. He's feeling better too. He kind of had a little bit of it too. Oh yeah. He's he's starting to feel better, but he's still getting through it. Um, you know, sometimes you just gotta. Sometimes you gotta cancel your plans when you feel like. You know, I don't know, disgusting, but um, I actually feel better. I'm still. I feel like I'm still like waking up, honestly. But it feels really good out here. Oh, I forgot about this ramp. See, my cousin was here with a wheelchair, and so we have to use this ramp. Yep. It's funny, it's easier for her, but it's hard for me to walk down inclined like this. Anyways, yep. Um, it feels really good out here. We're going to go grab some Chick-fil-A. We're not eating inside, though. I wanted to get it to go because my brother gave me two gift cards to... Um, oh, why am I? <laughs> He's trying to like open his car door. My brother gave me two gift what? cards to uh, Chick-fil-A Because that was like his get well present or whatever um, We're using this as a booster right now. I have my other booster in the Garage Actually, we have like three more boosters in the garage But um, this is the one that goes in the stroller. So we just use it sometimes because it was in here. So yeah, whatever um Anyways, but yeah, so like, sorry, you're all crooked and everything. Hi guys, you're like all crooked and everything. Um. Whoa. Oh. So he was jamming to Lauren, as you guys, you guys just almost went upside down. John Daigle. Sorry, you guys. He was jamming to Lauren Daigle. And um, so yeah, I don't know. We had like some sort of bug, but on top of mine, I also have, I have seasonal allergies. So like whenever the weather changes, like right now this weather's yo-yo. It literally is because it's like 70 right now and it was like 40 this morning and that's how it's gonna be for this week. And so like my voice was so hoarse like earlier and my throat felt like, I don't know, like sharp needles inside of it, like swallowing was super hard. I was like, this is so dumb. Um, and all I could do is honestly sleep and like, I got really hungry, so I'd eat like macaroni and cheese and grilled chicken, but my mom put like the pieces of grilled chicken inside of it, so it was like super good. And I even ate some pork roast yesterday, but I ate it with macaroni and cheese. Um, anyway, but that was a day and a half of, well, almost two days of, I don't know what it was. But anyway, um, I did have a slight fever, but it's gone now, so it's good. It's been gone, yeah, I had one like last night, it's been gone since last night. And my brother gave me my favorite, he sent home, because my mom went to take the kids home yesterday, and he like sent home like this big bag of my favorite popsicles. Oh my gosh, you guys don't even know, like these popsicles are so good. Anyway, I have a diffuser that Dot Nolan gave me, so I really want to put it back on. Did you know that the oils in it actually help you uh, when you're sick and help you breathe better? And my favorite is peppermint, and then there's lavender, and there's lemon, but like, I'm gonna have to do that because it actually smells really good and I did it over the summer when I actually had bronchitis and like literally within like 10 minutes I could breathe better like it was amazing anyways um so yeah welcome to the vlog where I didn't know I was gonna vlog today but why not I mean I gotta do something with my life <laughs> um so we're just gonna get the chick-fil-a we're just gonna get the chick-fil-a and bring it back because you don't really feel like going in anywhere but since my brother did give me the gift cards, I thought I'd use them today. Um, so, anyways, that's what's up with that. Click. Baby blue staring in the window pane, just counting drops of rain. Wondering if she's got the guts to take it. Running down her dreams in the dirty dress Now her heart's a mess Praying she will find a way to make it 
Don't keep on climbing all the ground I shake. Just keep on reaching all the limb I break. We've come this far, don't you be scared now? Cause you can learn to fly on the way down. Searching for a sign every night, even like a lonely string of lights that'll burn just long enough for you to reach it. The road's been long and lonely, and you feel like giving up. But there's more to this than just the breath you're breathing. I don't want to hurt the ukulele. Oh my god. The tenor ukulele at that matter. And this is actually not mine. It's Jacob's. So I gotta be careful. Ah! Sorry guys. I ain't trying to see my phone. And that's enough. song in two days you kind of might forget the words and I try not to but you know uh, awesome you guys just fell over be back <laughs> 